Okay, hello. To start to understand the means, we need to start with the circle. Yes, just one circle. For example, when we take this one, and of course taking the concepts between diameter and radius, of course the relationship between diameter and radius is very easy. And of course radius uh, is the same that uh, diameter by two, divided by two. And we can make a zoom like this one and try to start to understand the measure. For example, when you take a, a, a border point, for example, from this side until this point and call this by X, for example, and start in the circle and finish in one point. And after this point, between uh, this point and another point of the circle, and we can call this another measure by Y. And of course, x plus y is equal to diameter in this case. So of course, that we can we can call this measure in orange by radius, and radius is diameter divided by two. So after this, we can just to share a point here in the circle and make these measures and form a triangle. Of course, this triangle with an angle by 90 degrees. And it, after this one, we can understand that this measure is square, square root by x times y. So this is, is really simple to understand. But the thing here is that the first measure, x plus y divided by 2, is equal to uh, medium or mean. And the second one is the medium, again, but it's another medium, is geometric mean. Of course, we can understand this one, this, uh, these two concepts that, and of course we can change the measured points, but uh, here it's simple to understand that geometric mean is less than mean, okay? And after, if we can continue here, just uh, sharing another points, for example, from this point to the center is the same of radius, of course, and taking this another point here, we can form here another triangle and taking angles here, for example, alpha, and this one is 90 degrees, okay, and taking this one by beta, for example, and here we have another angle that this angle is beta, for example, and of course if this angle is beta, the another angle is alpha, and we have two uh, similar triangles to understand here. And after understand that these triangles are similar, we can understand all measures making some comparison. For example, if you take this triangle and with these angles, alpha, beta, and 90 degrees, we can take this one that is the same too, and we can just move in here and we can compare all measures about these two triangles. Okay? And making this, it's just uh, first of this is just to understand that the big one have an hypotenuse formed by the mean. In other words, we have x plus y divided by 2. Okay? And we have that all measures here is the geometric mean, and this one here in hypotenuse in another triangle is again geometric mean, and this one is another measure that we need to understand. Okay, and this measure is just this one, but this measure is really simple to understand. When we can compare all measures of similar triangles, we can make some algebra here and understand that this measure divided by geometric mean is the same that geometric mean divided by mean. Okay, and make some algebra here. We can understand that this measure, this new measure that we, we need to understand, we need to know is just this one, okay? But this is the same that 2 divided by this expression, and after that we can understand that this is the same that 2 divided by exactly 1 by x plus 1 by y. That means harmonic medium, okay? And this is the last one medium that we can express here and see geometrically. For example, this one. And when we change the point, the, the point in the border of this circle, for example, this, we have geometric mean, here we have the mean, and here we have harmonic mean, and here 
you can understand that 3 1 by G H and A okay and here when we change this point we can understand that this means our measures that we can compare for example in this case when we change here we can see that in all the cases the harmonic mean is less than the geometric mean that is less than the mean okay arithmetic mean in other words so we can change these points and this always happens okay and of course when this point is is more near that the radius we can arrive in some situation that these means are equal but in general we have this situation okay so independent of all the numbers x and y we have this kind of situation in other words we have and uh, this comparison between the means so harmonic mean is less than geometric mean and then less than arithmetic mean okay guys see you in the next video